I knew it was going to be tough and the track was tricky and I picked up an injury last weekend in New Zealand so um, really struggled all week to get fit for, for this race and then today the track was real ruddy so kind of had to be a little bit careful and I think it worked into my favour because I kind of, I was a little bit sort of just backed it down slightly and then I just was real consistent guys kept crashing around me all the time and um, managed to pull it off. Round one was, <laughs> mate, I don't even want to go there but um, you know, Bit of fault from the team, bit of fault from me, bit unlucky, just all rolled into one and it just it's got worse and worse, but um, rebounded here, five points off the lead in the championship. Still got some things we need to work on. We're better, but we're not good. I'm better, but I'm not good, so um, yeah, just keep working away. I'm feeling pretty good considering I haven't ridden, I've had three niggling injuries the last month because obviously I've been racing every weekend with New Zealand and um, I haven't ridden in a week in five weeks, so um, I'm hoping this week I can get on the bike, but uh, I'm not sure. So uh, and anyway, physical was pretty good. So I've still been swimming and running and, not running, but swimming and uh, gym and, and uh, cycling. So um, pretty happy with the way I pulled through today. To get the red plate, it's awesome. I've been dreaming about this for a long time to get the red plate. And uh, so leading the championship now, I know it's going to be tough. There's a lot of good riders and, you know, I don't plan on giving it up. I, I plan on keeping it on my bike. So got to put in a lot of hard work for the rest of the season and be consistent you know there's so many motos I just I can't throw any away you know I've got to be there for every moto. Jay and I find each other on the track quite a bit and uh, he handed me the whole moto and I dealt with the pressure which uh, I was quite proud of myself to be able to do that and uh, bring home the win. Then uh, moto two got off to a good start again and it was unfortunate Billy Billy had a really big crash in front of me so uh, he handed me the lead and that was that. I, I checked out to a six second lead and um, just maintain, maintain that for the rest of the, the moto and um, you know to go 1-1 one, one the last two was such a great feeling. Uh, to get the monkey off my back to get a moto win early in the season which was great last year I didn't get a moto win until the second last round and then it all started coming together so this will be a massive confidence boost for me and you know it'll be a lot, a lot more fun to train during the week knowing that uh, I got the championship lead. Yeah, it is. You know, it's pretty much my home race. So, uh, you know, I was come today, and I really wanted to win. You know, uh, I did the first two, and I won the first two convincingly, and then I went into the next two, and I actually whole shot both of them, and then I just made some silly mistakes. But uh, I was a long way back, and I fought the whole way, and uh, got back to where I needed to be to come away with the the win and now I've got a 47 point lead over Gibbsy so uh, you know I'm doing the right things I just got to eliminate these little mistakes because there's so many races and so many points so uh, as soon as I eliminate them and you know just keep the rubber side down you know I think I can stretch my points lead and just keep plugging away to get back to the US. It was really rough you know they watered it a hell of a lot so uh, you know it was really rough and rutted but at first it was a little bit one line and then the track got super rutted and you know you could go a lot of different lines so you know I like the track, I like the hard pack and I like the bumps so uh, you know it was good, unfortunately I made them mistakes but uh, you know it was a good weekend for us and the team and you know we're looking forward to next weekend. Yeah it's an unbelievable feeling, I've been, been working my whole life to be able to come out and do something like this and come away with all the wins and the red plate and 26 point lead I couldn't ask for much more. Yeah, it's definitely a big breakthrough for me. I've been working hard, I've been putting in the hours and uh, it's finally paid off and I don't plan on stopping from here. Hopefully I can just keep the ball rolling. 32 races, consistency is everything with this. It's, uh, I'll be happy with anything, like top, top seven's good and I need just points for the whole year and uh, hopefully we can come out on top at the end.